Ladies and gentlemen, it's a great pleasure to see you all here today. I have just come from a meeting with the UN Special Representative in Iraq, Ad Melkert. I'm going back now to meet him again for lunch. We again and again raised the question of Ashraf with Ad Melkert, so he is left in no doubt that this is a matter of great concern to us in the European Parliament. And he will go back to Iraq with this message. He will tell the Iraqi government that we will not tolerate the siege of Iraq. The loudspeakers that are blaring propaganda and hate messages 24 hours a day. The suppression of medicine to get into the very sick people inside the, the Camp Ashraf. All of these messages we have reiterated this morning in the presence of Ad Melkert. He is now well aware of what the Parliament thinks. I said this morning, since 2003, the taxpayers of Europe have given over 1 billion euros for the reconstruction of Iraq. We are not happy to go on paying this money at a time of financial austerity if the Iraqi government does not listen to our concerns. And our concerns right now are the human rights of the people of Ashraf. So I want to thank you for all of your work. You've been here all morning in freezing cold conditions. You are the brave people. You have the courage to stand up and fight for the people of Ashraf. We will do what we can. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.